hello guys you're welcome back to my channel yay anyways guys um my name is stephanie and i'm a mom tuber <laughs> I am a cook. I do vlogs on this channel. I even do story times. So if it's your first time coming across my channel, please just relax, take a glass of water and chill. So guys, today I'll be doing my hair routine, how I treat this hair. And today I'll be showing you how I deep condition my hair. I just took out those braids, um, no, not braids, um, butterfly locks. And I'll be showing you what I normally do to my hair to keep it soft and manageable and guys i hope you are going to enjoy it because this routine i've been doing it since i became natural and it has worked for me so much and i'll be showing you my secret ingredients what i do i'll be showing you how i do my deep conditioning with the ingredients i have at hand and yeah guys look at my hair it is so <laughs> untamed now and guys sorry my baby <laughs> Before this, if you want, I'll give you like a few tips on how to get long, thick hair. You see, my hair is not sparse. It is very thick and the length is really coming through. So I'll be telling you some of the mistakes that I made that I later on corrected to have this amazing growth and volume and everything. <laughs> so guys, the first thing you want to do is don't over manipulate your hair leave do protective styles that will last you for long my protective styles always last me from four weeks to eight weeks even more <laughs> those who know me know that ah when i do a protective style i can keep it for as long as three months and yes i'm comfortable with it and i'll be showing you how i take care of my protective styles how i renew them and how i make them look neat you know there's a time when after doing all that your hair keeping it for long your hair becomes itchy and stuff well, as time goes by, I'll be sharing some of my tips and tricks with you on how to like get very good and nice hair. So you don't want to be over manipulating your hair, you know. When you over manipulate your hair, it cuts off and it doesn't retain length and the volume too doesn't really come out that much. So please guys, don't over manipulate your hair. Find Okay, the second tip is find a routine that is good for your hair and stick to it. You can try the oils that people are trying, but the deep conditioners, guys, you have to, especially these DIY deep conditioners, you have to be very, very careful with it because some of them, they are not friendly to everybody's hair because a treatment that goes very well for 4C hair because my I have type 4 hair, it will not go for 4B or 1A, it will not go. So you right now what I've used on my hair to give it this amazing growth and please, if you want amazing results, just follow it step by step. And yes guys, thank you and as you watch, please like, subscribe and leave a comment and see you in my next video. So guys, the ingredients we are going to need are just three ingredients as you've already seen. Olive oil, honey and four eggs. Four eggs because my hair is very very thick and I'm going to mix it together in this blender and transfer it into the spray bottle that we'll be using to moisturize the hair with. So guys, as you can see, my hair is very, very dry from the last protective hairstyle I did. No oils in it, nothing. And I'm just going to part my hair into four and start spraying. I will go, I will spray right to my roots and massage the product so that it can penetrate into the roots of my hair. So that it will be easy to comb through when it's time to detangle. And guys, let me warn you beforehand, if you are doing this procedure, make sure that you wear a t-shirt that you just take off and wash because it's going to get very, very, very messy because it is, it is liquid and it runs, guys. <laughs> you are going to see the number of scarves that I'm going to tie on my head so that I should protect the leakage somehow, even though it's still going to leak, but yeah, I'm still going to protect it as much as I can.
so at this point i am done with the moisturizing and i'm trying to like braid up the hair so that i can put it in a nylon as i'm going you're going to see very soon i will wear a plastic over my head and i'll tie it twice so that i can stop it from leaking and guys when you do this style you when you do this on your hair you want to keep it for at least an hour it depends on you if you're not in a haze so or if you're not going out you can keep it the whole day because i actually kept mine on for the whole day i did it around 11 a.m and i took it off around 7 p.m yes when i was about to go and shower and guys trust me the results are mind-blowing try it and you'll thank me later And yes, guys, this is around 7 p.m. and I'm preparing to go and shower. I just wanted to show you the results. And guys, at this point, my hair feels so good. It is moisturized and my curls are just so bouncy. I'm, just, I'm not going to use shampoo on my hair. I'm just going to rinse it off with warm water and that is it. After rinsing it off, I'll just use my normal oil and then I'll pack it back into my normal simple protective style like what I've what I've just taken off right now guys I wish you could touch my hair and feel how soft it is my curls are they're just so amazing guys just try this and you thank me later and if you just started keeping natural hair and your hair is super thick and unmanageable not comable i'll advise you to do this at least four times a month that is every week you do it at least once but if you want double the results if you want to double the results sorry i'll advise you to do it twice a week yeah so guys thank you very much for watching this video hope it helps you and if you want more tips on having thick long and beautiful fussy hair please subscribe to my channel for more tips and i promise to bring you more updates and don't forget to leave a comment guys please always leave a comment when you watch my videos so that i know that we are being interactive even if you don't like the video please let me know in the comment section so that next time i'll try to improve and maybe bring what you like thank you so much and see you in my next one bye